Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov slash apod. And today's picture for June 9th of 2022. Well, it is titled Cosmic Clouds in Cygnus. So what do we see here? Well, here is an image taken looking at the sky in the direction of the constellation of Cygnus the Swan. And this is taken not with a telescope, but just with a camera and a telephoto lens to look out into the sky. So not all images we take need to be taken with a telescope. In fact, in many telescopes, the field of view can be so small that you only see a tiny portion of the sky, incredibly tiny. And if you want to get a wide field view and look overall at a larger section of the sky, this is a much better way to do that. Now we see this in this area we are looking at part of Cygnus as I said and that is one of the constellations that happens to be located in the plane of the galaxy. So we see a lot of nebula nebulae here and a couple of them that stand out we have up towards the top is NGC uh, 6888 which is an example of a nebula from a very young star called a Wolf, Wolf Rayet star. It's only a few light years across about 25 light years across and it's called the crescent nebula for its specific shape. And this is a very hot young star and pushing out its outer layers. So as hot stars are still forming and going through, through the early stages of their lives, many of the very massive stars expel great amounts of material. And we see these here. And these are also likely the stars that will go supernova at some point in their lives later on. Now, if we want to see another one, we can see a, another nebula here, and that would be off towards the lower right and that is known as the tulip nebula down there in the red for its distinct shape. And again, it is another nebula called an emission nebula, where a very young star, which we classify as a type O, which are some of the hottest stars, and that the ultraviolet radiation from that will energize the gas left over around from that star's formation. So it's a more recently formed star. Uh, that we see and we're still seeing some of that gas and dust around left over from its formation. So here we get to see really a wide field view about 10 degrees across. Now to get an idea of how 10 degrees is our moon is about half a degree. So you could fit about 20 full moons across the width of this image. That gives you kind of an idea of how much space it is taking up in the sky and we're getting a very wide field rather than many of the other pictures we look at which would focus in on just one or the other of these specific nebulae. So that was our picture of the day for June 8th of 2022. It was titled Cosmic Clouds in Cygnus. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.